Hello, and welcome back to New Gen Marketing. I'm your host, Joshua Stanley, and the owner of Lifestyled Media. Last week, we talked about a study that shows how Gen Z demands brand transparency and that brand neutrality isn't an option. We also discussed how important influencing your marketing with your values is. Today, I want to dive into a concept that we call Lean Into It here at Lifestyle. In addition to needing to have your values as a part of your marketing, you need to be explicitly authentic to who you are as a brand in everything that you're creating. This honesty, or at least adherence to who you claim to be, is essential. Last year, we worked on a campaign for the Pennsylvania governor race with Josh Shapiro who is now the governor of Pennsylvania. In conjunction with Germantown Media, we worked on the Josh Shapiro for Governor campaign. Josh Shapiro is white, and in trying to attract minority voters, oftentimes we see candidates who say, I get you, I understand where you're coming from, or I understand the issues that exist, so let me help you solve them. What we did instead was allow Josh Shapiro to lean into his different upbringing and build genuine, authentic discussions around him asking questions to these leaders and influencers about where the issues were and what they believed the solutions to be, allowing them to answer the questions rather than him telling them what it is. And this really allowed him to lean into who he already was, not pretend that he knew something he didn't, and come off truly authentic about where he is and where he is at. And the reception to this was amazing because... Josh Shapiro wasn't fronting. He wasn't pretending to be something he wasn't. And this is a fantastic example of leaning into whatever it is you are, leaning into your authenticity, leaning into whatever your brand stands for or where your brand comes from. Even beyond a racial difference, it can be anything. It can be belief systems. It can be location. Let's say you only work in the East Coast. Don't brand yourself nationally to try to gain an audience that you don't actually want. There's an old marketing saying that says if you're talking to everyone, you're talking to no one. And that is true across the board, but especially in Gen Z. You need to focus on who your target market is and be truly authentic to who you are and who you're talking to. Otherwise, you're not going to actually be communicating with the people you want to be communicating with. This concept of leaning into your authenticity of who you are goes across the board and whatever you're doing. Another great example is when we worked on a marketing campaign for a television show. And to attract that Gen Z audience, we shot film photography behind the scenes. So truly very raw, authentic feel showing things that normally aren't supposed to be showed. In traditional TV, you're hiding the behind the scenes. But in the marketing for it, we showed what was supposed to be hidden and had great reception for our Gen Z and millennials because they feel like they're being pulled into something special, that you're building a deep, genuine connection with your consumer, with your audience, that's that they don't feel like they're getting from other brands or from other marketing campaigns. The one thing you need to stay away from if you want to touch the millennial or Gen Z market is avoiding being disingenuous while still being authentic to who you are. You need to stay away from pretending to be something that you aren't or for believing in something that you don't. And you need to say, this is who we are. This is what we stand for and lean into the things you don't know. Thank you guys so much for listening. We'll link the project we did with the Josh Shapiro campaign in the show notes below, but I'd encourage you to check that out as a great example of simple, easy, authentic marketing. It wasn't anything crazy. It wasn't a high quality video interview. It was simple Zoom conversations, discussing issues and being authentic to who he was and to who he was speaking with. Until next time, this has been New Gen Marketing.